Uh, good day and welcome to this demonstration uh, that will show some nice integration around merging of different document types into a single PDF. Uh, this demo is built on the K2 Merging ex experience in which we can log into and, and run a number of different demos. So um, if you would like access to this environment, uh, let us know and we can provide you access to that. Uh, the demonstration is the PDF converter. So this is a K2 smart form that's been integrated with AdLib uh, and it's going to be responsible for collecting of the documents that we need to uh, convert and then actually doing the, the conversion and communicating with the process in the back end. So we're going to attach a number of different types of documents. So for example, uh, I might have a, a Word document uh, we want to upload. Uh, let's attach a uh, PowerPoint deck. Uh, we're going to attach a Visio diagram. Uh, we're going to attach a, uh, a, a Excel uh, document. We're also going to go and attach a CAD drawing. So these are, let's say, the documents that somebody has requested that I, that I sent to to them, uh, or you know, plans of maybe some building that I want to create or whatever it might be. Now the recipient of this, and maybe even myself, I don't have all the tools, all the different native applications to be able to open these different uh, document types. So what's quite nice here is that uh, I'm going to let uh, the AdLib engine be convert all of those into a single PDF so that I can read it on my mobile device or be able to send it to somebody else and at least they can access all that information. So I'm going to call this my new uh, house uh, proposal. As an example, so maybe it's plans for a home with CAD drawings and all sorts of things and a project plan, maybe Microsoft projects in there, a few different things. And I'm going to call this my, uh, my house, my house PDF. So I click the convert. And now what's happening here is this K2 smart form is going to communicate with a workflow process in the background. And I've told it to communicate back with a little bit of signal art here, a little bit of messages of the things that are taking place. So what's happened here is it's actually moved the document into uh, the, the documents into AdLib. Uh, the AdLib engine is now busy converting all of those into a single PDF and providing me with uh, some feedback about what's taking place uh, over here. And then once that's completed, uh, we're then going to be able to access that document on the screen and download it. Of course, this is just a, a little uh, a basic example. Just go to the form, pass in the information, and bring it back. Uh, you can obviously take this further and maybe fetch that, th those documents from, from other locations, or perhaps even have the output of this go to uh, another location entirely. Maybe even s automatically send it as an email to somebody, or uh, go and put it into a document management system like SharePoint or, uh, uh, or uh, HP Record Manager, or various different places. So uh, that's now taken place. So let's uh, click on the uh, PDF document. So if you open that up, it's just opened up on my uh, on my other screen here. Let's drag that drag that down into here. And what we'll see if I zoom in, that it's now added my new house proposal at the top. It was the title that I gave it. I can see it's 11 pages. It's created a, ta a table of contents, which I really like. Uh, effectively, I can see all the things that have been attached into this document. It's not just a merge of documents. It's, it's done a bit more than that. And this now gives me the ability to be able to immediately you know, go down to those different sections and have a look at the detail that's, that sits inside there. You'll notice it's even looked at the, 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 the document, found this, the different headings that are inside there, and I can drill directly to those, uh, those different sections. Uh, it's also created a little uh, bookmark side over here, so I can go back to the table of contents, maybe go and look at that uh, that um, uh, AutoCAD drawing, so there's a little AutoCAD drawing, uh, I can go and have a look at the PowerPoint uh, slide that was uh, embedded inside here, so that there's that, uh, zoom out a little bit, there's a PowerPoint slides, the Visio diagram, the Excel spreadsheet, and those uh, calculations that are, that are sitting inside the, the worksheet. You can see all of that just very nicely rendered. I can now take this document, it's a PDFA document, and I can now send that to, to anybody uh, that will be able to read this document with, uh, with a PDF reader. What I'm going to do as well is extend this demonstration uh, um, to incorporate into a business case approval. So to take that, that scenario a little bit further, uh, imagine if you've got documents that you need to send around for approval inside of an organization. Uh, what you'll be able to do then is uh, go and fill in the, the details of what, what you need to approve, attach the different documents. So, for example, I could go here and say house plans. 
attach that document. And then I could decide whether I want a PDF rendition of that. So that's an attachment. When I hit generate PDF, what that's doing is it's calling a, a little K2Smart form that's also integrated. It's doing the conversion for me. Once it's completed, it puts that document uh, as a PDF rendition side by side. So if this is a, a business case and I, I start uploading different types of documents, I can go and I submit this through and everybody that's part of the approval process, uh, if they've got the native application, they can look at the, 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 the drawings in, in the native application, or if they don't have it, they can still review them as a PDF document. Um, so look out for that demonstration, I'll, I'll be releasing that uh, shortly and we'll integrate that into a record management system from HP um, as well, either Trim or HP Record Manager 8.